Hello everyone, this is Sridhar from Melon Tech Training Institute. In this video, we are going to discuss about why we have to freeze cells as well as ranges in Excel. We'll discuss by using an example. Here I'm taking a table as an example where it is consisting of date, brand as well as quantity. And in this particular scenario, I just wanted to find total quantity sold for each brand. Okay, so for this particular scenario, we can use a formula called SUMIF. So I'll use SUMIF, which will make the sum based on the criteria met. Okay, so here I'm going to look for lava. Okay, so I'll just look for lava in brand, list of brands. That is nothing but range. Okay, so what is our criteria? This lava is our criteria. Okay, sum range. So this quantity is nothing but sum range. Let's close it and press enter. You'll get the answer. Yeah, perfect. So in order to apply the same formula for below cells also, I'll just copy paste the formula. Yeah, so now I got the answer. Let us verify whether it is correct or not. So here it is giving 1200. So I'll, I'll just check for this lava, yes, 300 and then 400 and then 500. So 300 plus 400, 700, 700 plus 500, which is 1200, correct. But when it comes to apple, so apple yeah 200 and then 400 then it is 100 how much is total 200 plus 400 600 600 plus 100 700 but here you are getting 500 as the answer okay let it be so let us check for nokia so nokia here it is 100 and then 200 and then 200 300 what is the total sum 100, 200, 300, 300 plus 200, 500, 500 plus 300, 800. Actually, it should be 800, but you are getting 700 as the result. Okay, so which is incorrect. So, what is the reason for this? Okay, I'll just check it. I'll just double click and I'll see the formula which is correct. That will come for this apple. Yes, formula is correct, but here if you can see, your range is moving down, one cell down correct so here in nokia here also same so here it is moving two cells down okay so the range of selection is wrong okay so in order to you know avoid this what we can do is here we can freeze the range so freeze the range in the sense we have to make that range constant which should not move along with your formula correct so what i can do is i'll just select the range and I'll press F4, okay, which will add dollar symbols. That is anything but freezing. So just select this cell F4 and then select this range, press F4, which will freeze entire ranges as well as cells. I'll just drag it down, okay. So now you are getting the same answer everywhere. Let us check the reason, okay. So if you double click on this, you'll see the formula. And if you can see here, so everywhere it is taking criteria as lava itself. Actually, it should show uh, it should take apple, right? So if you come for this here, it should take this Nokia as a criteria. Still, it is referring to lava. That means it has freezed that particular reference. Okay, so it should not happen. So we have to freeze. The, uh, you know, we have to unfreeze it. So we'll just remove this freezing. I'll hit press enter i'll just drag it down yes so now we got the correct answer you can see here okay so here your range is correct and here your criteria criteria is also correct okay this is how you can make use of this freezing concept okay so i hope you understood the concept and thanks for watching have a great day